And I want you to stay with me. Oh, I my breath. It knocks me right off on my feet. I can't explain why you love and makes me feel. I get to. Oh, good morning, good afternoon, people. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Mental House with me, your host, Khadija. You know, we talk about mental illness a lot on this channel. And I know a lot of y'all try to dismiss uh, the mental health community as a money grab. And I'm sure, and most of y'all that feel that way is probably crazy as hell. <laughs> Never had nobody to address it. Because something makes you different. Now, I'm, I'm not saying that um, therapy is for everybody. But having someone to talk to that is not related to you. Who can challenge your thought. Because you, you're not going to get that in a certain environment where the whole environment um, acts that way. So, you have to go, and in order for it to be a productive conversation, you're going to probably have to go to someone unrelated to that neighborhood, situation, community that you're involved in. Okay? So, it's important that your mental health is just important as any other part of your body. And for us to understand that is so important. And I talk to all my uh, show business, entertainment friends, creative people. Because that's what makes us us. Is our ability to um, be creative. Um, brain go all kinds of ways. Especially comedians. I mean, <laughs> I ain't never seen nobody so crazy. But anyway... I'm trying to talk about Tasha Scott, and I'm I'm really hoping because her situation in a, in a lot of ways reminds me of what happens when you have a personality disorder of some sort, and you haven't been made to deal with, and it's it's a habit, and it's a stain on your personality. That you can sit up with somebody and think that everybody around you is crazy except for you. And you guys are coming up with stories and uh, examples and reasonings and lies that to explain a situation away that everybody up under your voice, no, it just don't even feel right. And then the worst part is to hear you trying to do a gospel album is pretty much insulting. It's insulting. Because if you, you, since you out here stealing, allegedly, if you out here stealing, <coughs> everybody know you stealing. Because it was played out on television. Now, I done done a lot of things in my life. I, I've done a few things that I'm not particularly proud of. Okay? Um, like, I don't know a person alive who hasn't. Okay? Um, but one thing about it, when you steal something, like I remember stealing from my brother, one of my brothers. Um, and, of course, you know, we were teenagers or whatnot. But it doesn't really matter. The fact of the matter is, I had to come clean with it. Because I felt bad. I was like, listen. 
I'm sorry for taking your money. And you know what? I'm going to do what I can do to replace your money. And now this and and if it had been a situation where it's thirty thousand dollars and this has got going on on national TV, I in my heart of thinking I would have said, "Listen, I was at a I was in a bad state of my life when I did that, like I was, and I wish I hadn't have done that, but I did, and the end result is I have to replace what I took from you." And I'm sorry I took that from you. Now, people will probably look at you and say, mm, that was terrible for her and Rocky to do that, allegedly. <laughs> but they would have to honor your, your honesty. You understand what I'm saying? They would have to honor your honesty and be like, okay, well, we're going to give you a second chance. Um, because you opened yourself up to the criticism. You were already getting that. You opened yourself up at the end of the day. You need your sister back and you want her back. And you want you don't want that to be in be between y'all. But that's not what happened. It's not what happened at all. And what's happening is you're digging yourself more and more lies to the point now I will quit. Because your hus your husband looked crazy on, on TV, licking his mouth, talking about he don't do no stealing. And he looked crazy. He like he's on he on drugs or something. And I'm sure that's not the case. But and then he looked like a bully. Okay? So you you need to let him respond to his questioners uh and then when he says some, the way you shut your mouth and get out of it is to tell the truth. You got to be like, baby, we can't keep doing this because that's my sister. And if you want to keep on dragging your family through the ground, you must don't care about them at all either in, in order to let him do that. Talking about you got a, 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 a tape and stuff or the, here's the new. I'll just listen to him deflect when he was talking to um, another. Uh, who was it? Well, another. I think it was Tasha K. I was just listening to him, and I'm like, this guy. And that's one thing about a person with a person with with these personality disorder. They tell lies upon lies upon lies. They gaslight. They gaslight, and they project. They project. You see, the brat wasn't gonna let it happen. She wasn't. So here's what I suggest. You know, as 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 the 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 person looking in on this. To all of y'all, I I mean, I'm not gonna talk bad about you because I've been there in that situation, and it wasn't until I realized that I don't want to be lying about every damn thing, and I definitely don't want to be lying to cover up this Negro or this. You know, woman, I'm not going to do that. So the first thing is I got to do is, again, come clean with it. That's why I love this segment of the, uh, that I'm going to start bringing to the channel. In fact, um, I think it's a very good therapy when you come clean with something. I come clean with a lot of stuff on Patreon. Um, and... It's important to have a space to do that. But Rocky nor Tasha is being upfront. They're not being honest. And at this point, I don't think they know how to be. That's the buck naked truth. All right? All right, so I'm out of here. If you like what you hear, surprise, do better, people. Do better. If you like what you hear, subscribe and share the channel. I'll see you in the next video. We got to do better.